hey guys welcome to crypto bulls club my name is soham so if you're new to this channel make sure you smash up the like button hit the subscribe button because guys we come every day with a bitcoin analysis and we had told you about this recent crash and i'm gonna show you proof where we told you and today's video is gonna be something you know something a little different from the other videos that we had made we are gonna discuss why at this point of time we are so bullish about the bitcoin price in the coming months right so at this point of time as you can see the bitcoin price had broken out of this rising wedge right and uh, this is on the weekly chart let me go to the daily chart first and you will be able to see it's few of the things that we want to highlight and couple of things that we have never shown you couple of indicators that i have never shown you as well so here it becomes much more clearer that yesterday the bitcoin price had broken to the lows of about twenty thousand eight hundred dollars but today we have uh, you know risen uh, you know, a little bit 20, about 21,000 is what we are trading on we went to the highs of about 21,350 as well but uh, you can see the scandal that we got a rejection now there is no Fibonacci right here or there is no moving average right here as well but there is a certain trend line which made bitcoin got rejected you know which made bitcoin reject at these particular levels what is that so for that we are gonna get the gan fan right guys the gan fan is something that we have never discussed or we have never showed in our videos earlier so the gan fan actually tells us about the trend lines the fibonacci level so here on the gan fan what we can see is clearly that we went up and we got rejected right at this yellow line guys okay you can see this very very clearly if you haven't plotted this gan fan yet i strongly recommend you doing this for your analysis it will actually help you understand the levels of resistance and supports as well guys okay so we as you can see we went up we got rejected right at the gan fan and that is why we saw a pull to the downside now the agenda for this video is to show you a relation between the dollar index and the bitcoin price right guys we had tweeted about something very important from the dollar index i'm going to show you that as well but first let me tell you why i am so bullish about the bitcoin price for the next couple of months let's say at least right why i believe that the bottom could really be in for the bitcoin price very very soon so for that what we are going to do is we are going to move to the one month chart first let me do that and let me plot the rsi so the rsi will actually help us understand a few things right and uh, let me quickly pull out the rsi first because the rsi actually tells us in a little bit of advance if you are reading it correctly that yeah we can actually you know so we can actually uh, you know understand where the market could be heading in the next few days so on the rsi on the monthly what we can see is you will be able to see this clearly as well right guys we are actually forming a double bottom on the monthly rsi guys absolutely you can see this clearly right we made the first bottom right here when uh, in back in june and right now also we are trying to make another bottom in june the the rsi was at about 41.67 currently the rsi is at 42.77 so it's a higher low as well as a double bottom on the monthly rsi and this could be signs that we might actually move to the north very very soon and the bottom could actually be in for the bitcoin price very very soon as well but have we made the bottom for that what we're going to do is we're going to move back to the daily chart and on the daily chart we're going to analyze the rsi right on the daily chart however what we can see is you will be able to see this clearly now is that we are currently forming a kind of another beer flag guys okay another beer flag is getting formed on the monthly on the daily rather on the daily rsi and this is a sign of a little bit concern because we believe that we may head towards the downside again where could be you know where could we head down to for that we are going to pull out the fibonacci and on the fibonacci what we can see is the next level of support if we break this recent low could be at around the 18000 mark or 17930 mark which is the 161.8 fibonacci will we go there only time can say but on the rsi we are a little bearish on the daily but on the monthly we are extremely bullish now what i want to show you is uh you know we always mention about that there should be some confluence among the charts right because why am i saying that okay um there is a double bottom getting formed on the 
monthly RSI uh, for Bitcoin. But what are some of the other factors? For that, what we are going to do is we are going to head over to the dollar index. So let me first pull out the dollar index. It will help us in understanding, you know, where the dollar and what could be the strength for the dollar in the coming days, right? So uh, let me quickly pull out the dollar index, guys. So here we go. We have the dollar index right here. And the dollar index has been, you know, inversely co-proportional with Bitcoin. We had discussed this earlier as well and some of the other assets class as well. Now, as you can see, the dollar index is currently at about 108, right? It made, uh, you know, a high, a local top of about 109.29 back on 14th of July. Now, why was this a breakout, right? We can see that it broke out of the falling wedge. And first of all, we are going to tell you that how we predicted the bottom, why we predicted uh, that Bitcoin could actually come down, right? And not only Bitcoin, for other markets as well. For that, we need to head over to Twitter, right? Because Twitter is the place where we keep you up to date from all the real-time analysis as well. So on Twitter, what we can do is we can head over to a tweet that we made on the 14th. Yeah, on uh, this was a tweet that we made about four days back. This was about on... 16th of July rather okay and at that moment of time the dollar index was at about 106 and we what we had tweeted was the dollar index has broken out of the falling wedge and today trying to come down and treat it as a support which it did eventually as a support before the next leg up this could be bad for the markets in general we had tweeted about this on 16th of August and the Bitcoin price broke down on the 19th, right? And this is why guys, I strongly recommend you follow us on Twitter. It is extremely, extremely important. And here you can see that we came down, treated it as a support. We are on the dollar uh, daily index and uh, you know the daily chart and you will be able to see we came down on 16th and from 17th, 18th, 19th, it just continuously went to north and the markets actually struggled quite a bit as well but there are certain things that are indicating that the dollar might actually be topping out and we might actually uh, see some recoveries in the market now treat this as a support to the monthly rsi double bottom forming on the bitcoin chart right so because as we have discussed earlier as well, the dollar index and Bitcoin are inversely co-proportional. Now, let me go to the weekly chart for the dollar index. This will give us a bigger picture. And what we are going to do is we are going to uh, let me remove these indicators. First of all, let me remove, uh, you know, the RSI so that you are able to see clearly. OK, and I'm going to remove these, uh, you know, a couple of drawings as well so that you are able to see this. Right. So, yeah. Now, what we're going to do is we are on the candlestick chart, but we have told this repeated number of times. If you want to see a pattern on the chart, head over to the line graph. So let me plot the line chart on the line chart. It is becoming extremely, extremely clear, guys, that the dollar index is forming a double top right here. OK, you can see this clearly. This is a clear clear double top right here this is the first double top this is the second double top right here so this is the first top and this is the second top actually this is the second top and this was the first top which it made in july 11th that indicates guys that you know the dollar might actually come down okay and that might be actually a great great news for the global markets as a whole because uh, every asset class, most of the asset class rather is inversely co-proportional with the dollar and Bitcoin is definitely, definitely co-proportional. So why I feel the next couple of months is going to be extremely, you know, uh, bullish might not be in September, by, but uh, probably October, November, December. I feel that the market has great chance of heading back to about probably about 30,000 or so. Why am I saying that? The re simple reason for that is you know, there is a double bottom on the monthly as well as a double top on the dollar index indicating a pull down from the dollar and, a, you know, a rise for all the asset classes, right? So guys, this is extremely, extremely important. And uh, if you like this kind of analysis, make sure you subscribe to our channel, smash up the like button, and we are going to come to you with all the analysis every day. Thank you so much for tuning in. Stay blessed, stay happy. Take very, very good care of yourselves. Bye-bye for now.